today we're at the Aprilia dealership here in Bryanston and we're really thankful to IMI, the Italian motorcycle importers, for bringing Aprilia back with power and passion into the country South Africa. I'm standing in front of the Aprilia Moto Guzzi IMI dealership here in Bryanston, Bryanston Boulevard. So if you're in the St. and Bryanston area, please pop down and have a look at their store. They've got a really cool vibe going inside, sort of a man cave. They've got a coffee shop. You can get light lunches, light, light uh, breakfasts. And the guys inside are super cool, passionate, knowledgeable about the product. And uh, it's just a fantastic place to go see awesome Italian motorcycles. But back to why we're here. We're going to be looking and reviewing the flagship superbike of Aprilia. We have the 2020 Aprilia RSV 4 1100 factory. More about Aprilia. They are most known for their efforts and dynasty of the achievements around the tracks around the world with 54 world titles in uh, the lower classes 1 to 5, 250 all the way up to world superbike racing and they have really big names that used to race for them and won championships such as Valentino Rossi winning in the 1 to 5 and 250 class, Max Biaggi winning multiple titles in the 250 Grand Prix class and then moving on and finishing his career winning two titles in the world superbike on this RSV4 earlier models and Back to this RSV4, its dynasty and heritage, the frame started and is conceived from the very successful 250cc Grand Prix racer, which has got a total of 18 world titles and 143 Grand Prix wins to its name. And what's very unique to this RSV4 as well is that it is the only production superbike where you can completely set up the bike to your needs, from rake and trail in front all the way to the pivot point of the rear swing arm as well as you can actually change the position of the motor within the frame and to you guys that race and are extremely competent track riders you would know you can set this bike up to your riding style and you can get the maximum performance out of this package which is unique to the RSV4 Aprilia. This being the top of the range super bike it's adorned with and specced with the finest materials and really cool trick bits. Let's go through them starting at the bottom. You've got ultralight forged front and rear rims, which is really good for change of direction. Next, you've got Brembo brakes front and rear, ABS brakes front and rear. Your suspension front and rear is Olin's, and more about that later because it's not just Olin's, it's semi-active suspension. Going up, you have a whole bunch of carbon fiber parts, which keep the weight of this bike really low. Your motor, as mentioned before, is a 65 degree V4, first in superbike production as a V4. Really narrow motor, ultralight using magnesium for the heads, casing, sumps, etc. Going on to the exhaust is an ultralight titanium street legal Acropovic pipe. And with all this weight saving, the weight with full tank on this bike is 199 kilograms and its horsepower standard in this guise is 217 horses, which means you have over one horsepower per kilogram. Then, moving on, you will see it has wings derived from the GP project. And these wings are not just cosmetic, they designed in the wind tunnel and are positioned at an angle where it gives you maximum performance for anti-wheeling as well as stability in high-speed braking. You will also see that the bike is in a monoposto guise, meaning single seater, but you have the rear foot pegs, which means you can lift this cowl and fit a second seat should you wish to have a pillion with you. Besides all the ultralight components and materials in this bike and all the trick bits thrown at it, the bike is also fully loaded with electronic wizardry. We spoke about the Olin's Swedish suspension. Being the top suspension, it also has for the first time the RSV semi-active suspension and the Olin's engineers have found up to half a second a lap in performance. The ECU doesn't only control the front suspension, it also controls the Olin steering damper. And besides the electronic semi-active suspension, you also have traction control, launch control, wheelie control, uh, you've got a pit lane limiter, you've got an open throttle up and down quick shifter, and finally, also you have a cruise control on this bike, should you want to go cruising with it. You also have a 
really beautiful TFT full color dash. And you'll see all your switches are ergonomically laid out, really nice to use, comfortable. And I think what we're gonna do now is we're gonna switch her on, show you what the dash looks like and listen to her glorious sound. What a stunning machine and a glorious sound to go with her. If you enjoyed this Aprilia episode, remember to click like and subscribe and follow us on Route 21.